It is 70 minutes past seven. Thank you so much for staying with Morning Live. Now, for all the motorists who are going back home as the holiday mode is over and for further information on the traffic situation returning home from the Easter weekend, we now cross over to our reporter, Lutando Pobodi, who is with the Minister of Transport, Joe Masongwanyi. A very good morning to you again, Lutando. It's over to you. Good morning. As I promised earlier on, uh, I'm standing by with the Minister of uh, Public Transport, Minister Joma Songani, who's going to give us a detailed account of what transpired on our public road. Um, uh, Minister Macheroni, what can, can you just um, give us uh, an overall reflection of what uh, transpired on our road during the Easter weekend? Uh, so far, the fatalities standard around uh, 105. Uh, we rely in the main from uh, police who collect uh, the data. However, I want to indicate that uh, there are two major accidents which has uh, increased the statistics. is uh, the bus crash in KwaZulu-Natal, Mendel's Drift Road, where 112 people died on the accident scene and three people died in hospital. That accident, it was as a result of a driver who does not have a valid driver's license. He does not have a valid PRDP. I'm told his driver's license has long expired. I don't understand why should somebody get into the road without a valid uh, driver's license. We must take uh, harsh measures. We must withdraw licenses. We must send people to jail, for instance. We must take out the discs of uh, some of the vehicles which are not roadworthy. And that bus, it looks like it was not even roadworthy. So we have to be even very harsh on the operators, bus and taxi owners who take taxi and buses into the road knowing very well that uh, they are not roadways. And the other incident is that one in uh, 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 Western Cape where eight people died. Also, it was as a result of reckless driving whereby a small uh, buggy, a Corsa, was overtaking so many cars and ended up uh, colliding with a bus, and people, eight people died. All these thing, uh, problems are as a result of uh, human factors that could be avoided. But the law must really take its own course on the uh, reckless drivers and uh, operators or owners who put on road with the vehicles on the road. And your message to uh, motorists traveling on this Easter Monday? I would like to appeal to uh, drivers that uh, drive safely, observe the rules of the road, see to it that uh, whatever vehicle that you are driving is uh, roadworthy. Also want to appeal to uh, pedestrians that uh, because we also experience the problem of pedestrians, uh, don't walk around on the roads uh, using uh, 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 headphones, uh, listening or phoning or texting. Uh, let's make sure that we observe the rules of the road because one life is too many to us. Uh, thank you so much. And uh, uh, a massive bulk of traffic is expected to come through um, uh, in the next two uh, or so hours. And just stay tuned to SABC News because I'm going to be giving you updates throughout the day.